All right, Justin, welcome to Shogun Total War. I know I said I wanted to play Napoleon, but I forgot to install it, and we are short on time tonight, so we just jumped into a game we both had installed. Similar game, similar gameplay. Uh, we're playing co-op campaign. You're the, are you the Yusege? Yeah, I decided to be the Yusege this time. Okay, and I'm the Takeda. Um, I hit enter right out the gate, so I didn't do anything with my first turn. Great start to a great campaign. It, it was a great uh, moment in life. Yeah, so now it's over to you. You can do whatever you want. Um, hey, I'm going to enjoy this turn and savor it. <laughs> in the past, we've had some issues getting Shogun to run for some reason. So if none of you ever see this, then there you go. Justin crashed two turns into this, and we scrapped the recording. See, and the hope is I've gotten a new computer since then, so, you know, maybe, just maybe the game won't crash. You know, oh, good. It does let me build buildings when it's not my turn. Oh, good. Did you pick your... I'm so sorry. Did you pick your master? I did. Gosh dang it. I'm going to be... I'm going to lose the tech race. They're going to get the Alpha Centauri before me. Oh, gosh. But yeah, oh, no, so we've tried this game a couple times, and it just... No, no indication, nothing. Just all of a sudden, it stops, and you're like, "Oh, my computer just got lockjaw, and now it's dead." <laughs> yeah, it's the worst kind of crash. No error message, nothing like that. Just boom, desktop. You want to hit enter again? It worked last time. <laughs> no, no. This time I might actually be productive. <laughs> uh, so, if I remember correctly, I want to get money because that's something I've always run short on in Shogun. Is you run out of money so fast. Yeah, and I will if you say, don't plan for it. Right out the gate, out of all the Total War games, this is probably one of the hardest, or at least one of the most unforgiving. Definitely. That is a fair assumption. If I remember correctly, these guys up north, I'm not quite powerful enough to fight them yet. I'm going to build a few more... What do I have? A few more archers, because early game, all of the castles are super tiny, and you can just pick them apart from inside their own walls. Until you run out of arrows. So you run out of arrows, but that's why I am going to take the Bushido and work my way down to the tech that gives me more arrows. <laughs> You're like, I've got a plan. I've got a plan. I've got a very shaky plan. Oh, heavens. Yeah. Okay, so, and my taxes, I'll leave my taxes the same right now. Anything else? Oh, diplomacy. Should probably get that worked out. Okay, everyone hates me. That was quick. On to you. Did you um? Did you ever beat a campaign in this game? Yeah, I did. Hey, you remember? Um, I don't know if you were there for that. Freshman year it of college. Was, it might have been freshman or sophomore. I don't remember. I think you were um, the Takeda if you did. I was not. I was the Tokugawa. Tokugawa. And it was that campaign where I was, you know, just kind of taking my time, conquering a province at a time, and then I look at the requirements and it said, "You've got three more years to finish this campaign." And I was like, shit. <laughs> so I just blitzed my way to Kyoto and managed to get it with a year left. Not a year left, a turn left. See, I remember I remember one part where, yes, yeah, screw it, I'm going to do it. Um, where I think you were like, you know what, screw it. Let's put the game on a higher difficulty. And you just got stomped <laughs> so fast. Very basically. short. Yeah. yeah. I, took, I, was, I remember that. I was playing as the Date and I took, wow, that was fast. You know what? Uh, Something's got to be done. I was playing as the Date. I took one, I took one province, and then the next three turns were just a desperate defense. And then on the fourth turn, they finally got me. Finally got you, as in they put you out of your misery. Yeah, because I mean, as a player, you can you can cheese your way into a few victories when you're outnumbered, but you can't do it back to back to back. As shown in that Rome video, am I right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. You fought admirably. But those purple bastards got you. I always knew when the Romans wear purple, they mean business. Well, that was a fast fucking peace treaty. Uh, so, no, I'm not going to betray my ally like that unless you pay me a ton of money. I hate you. Oh, don't worry. When we, has... when we play Civ, we'll be against each other in some way, shape, or form, so no worries. <laughs> he only has 175 gold in this treasury. See, cheap, I need to skin. kill him. You need to. <laughs> He's like, enough brave men have died. It's time to end the fighting. Sir, I haven't this, even gotten to your town yet. This pseudo Mercedes Benz esque clan. I mean, if you look at his uh, temperament, it's peaceful. So I'm like, mm, 
I'm so sorry, buddy. Well, how did he get himself dragged into this war? Because Peaceful. I walked over to his land and said, I want to kill you. Oh, you declare war on him? I did it. I'm going to pretend I didn't hear that and just assume it was a preemptive strike on your part. Yes, that. That one. I totally am in the right. Yeah. Take this one. Warehouses. Warehouses sound great. Let's build those. What? Are they like house? Are they like people that turn into houses when the moon hits? Yes. It's really awkward, especially when they're like in the middle of the road and all of a sudden there's just a house there. Yeah, they just Snorlax the road. <laughs> this guy just... It's the full moon. He just... Just, he just dropped. Well, shit, I don't know what instrument I have to play to get this thing out of the way. The flutes fucking, work on you? A fucking bandsaw? P play the bandsaw. Well, I'm taking oh, your you... advice. I'm going to bring arrows out. Okay, if you're fighting a battle and you can handle it on your own, I'll just take some sweet camera shots. I'm going to try. Hey, I was look. thinking for the battles. I was thinking for the battles, if they take too long and they're just kind of grindy, you can kind of cut them up just to the best bits. We'll just make it an epic, like, slideshow. Yeah, make uh, not a, yeah, just like a highlight reel. Ex that. That one. And, yeah, unless we get to some really big battles or some fucking real pivotal moments, then we'll just give you a highlight reel of what's going on. I had two different comments. One was a Tokugawa or dead, but the other one is crap. I'm picking up your habit. I have, like, I have this thing on my desk and i'm starting to play with it and i set it down in front of the mic i'm like no see it's a it's a bad habit because you you don't hear it when you're you know in real life but when you're listening to the recording it's like a bomb going off you're like oh geez what oh like i'm gonna pick up this envelope and put it on my desk and i'm gonna be able to hear that in the recording and we'll call it out when we see the the video later and be like look hey you're making too much noise in the background ah unprofessional well we are not professionals <laughs> we are We're... literally doing this after work yeah after i assembled a, a table for my living room oh yeah okay yes. so you're slightly more productive slightly more productive you not know... of my own free will however you think you didn't want a table i mean we didn't have a table so it was kind of a necessity thing i could have gone without assembling it tonight though Okay, that's fair. I mean, I did already eat, so I don't need a table. <laughs> it's not necessary, you know? Okay, I should have enough dudes well, to get rolling. For the guy it's asking cold. how the weather is, your side, it's freezing cold. <laughs> yeah, it's fucking cold over here. Uh, how's the weather where you're living? Um, 45 degrees. Okay, see... It snowed for Christmas, and then it's just like, all right, let's turn the heat back up. You see, four months ago, I would have said that was... However... What I'm dealing with right now is significantly colder. You're like, I'm currently in the phase where I'm potentially going to die. Yeah, I'm in the phase right now where um, I am never going to take for granted a 50 degree day again. 50 degrees is nice. 60 degrees, I think, I think it's like 55, 60 is what the perfect time. Oh, I, I'm an idiot. Speaking of winter. Did you I do what I did and are standing in Atlanta for attrition? Yeah. I wasn't thinking, didn't look at the terrain, and I just marched them into winter attrition. So. Your guy gets his little chair out, sits down, and it's like, yep, I guess I'm going to die here. Yep, I'm not going to start a campfire or anything. I'm just going to sit here and hold my flag until the cows come home. And boy, home they will come. Yeah, you know, cows are pretty slow. I guess that's what the phrase means. All right, well, I got to get in here before winter's up, so. Yeah, all right, it's a pretty even battle. I guess I'll just, uh, I don't know what I, I guess I hit spectate. There you go. And if you do get to a battle where it's too micromanaging, you can hand me units, remember? Yes, which I think is also a cool little tidbit in this game. Oh, it's so nice. It's better than, it's better than Empire's. Empire was the one where you automatically fight him as the enemy, to which, you know, the phrase, I hate Amsterdam, comes about. <laughs> oh, absolutely. And it gets so repetitive, because if you fight the same person over and over again, it's not like you're... You're not fighting England. You're not fighting France. You're not fighting Italy. You're just fighting the same person as a different color over and over and over. Well, and the worst part, specifically with the Amsterdam part, was it was the same units over and over again. It was just some rebel this, militia. The same thing. units, the same units, the armed mob, uh, the same map with that star fort that breaks in the same places. And no matter what you do, you can always defend it in the same spot. Yep. 
that stupid wall. So every time I had to take that thing back, it was like, I think, five different sessions of just ordeal. <laughs> well, pretty standard. The General Bodies Guard, the Boashigaru, and all the way on the other side, while they they bet wrong when they place their units, most of everybody else is on the other side of the castle. Well, they're they just leaving. The retainers are the outside the castle. Yeah, yeah, I saw that. Um, what do you think about running, my guys, right now? Wait until they're in the line. I usually walk my guys until they're actually under fire. That's what's happening right now. Then run them. It's like they're just going to get shot otherwise. Or at least run the one that's getting shot at. Because they can only shoot at one at a time if you're not bunched up. Yeah, well, and they're on the perfect hill, so I can just see these guys getting a calf day right now. Yeah, this this game is always so brutal, even with things as simple as arrows. Guys are just getting impaled with multiple arrows at once. Yeah, well, good news is once I get up top, game over. <laughs> are they going to come? That was depressing to watch. My little, the guy that was holding the banner for the Ariashigaru fell straight down the cliff. I forgot, how do I raise the camera? Go up. Oh, duh, I'm an idiot. I just zoom out. All right, guys, stop firing. You're probably killing your own guys at this point. Nope, 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 nope. Get off the wall, get off the wall, get off the wall. <laughs> there oh, you go. That guy got stabbed. Stabbing people is fun. God, I love the fighting animations in this. And this this is the game where they finally got the fighting in. In Empire, the tracking was off, so you'd have guys 20 feet apart same fight animation uh -huh. and in medieval it just took ages but this one they f i think they finally got it right oh my archers going that and I, just, it's the amount of guys just falling off the wall trying to get up there <laughs> that guy just got kicked come on samurai do a little bit more damage they're not doing any damage all right i think we lost this one we'll see we'll see but hey, get their bowmen out of here Wait, who's running now? My my samurai. I lost eight general bodyguard climbing the hill. Yeah, that's brutal. I yeah yep I lost I lost. There's no way. Not at this point. Unless my guys can actually take them on. Oh no. I don't think this is gonna happen. No, it's not. I I messed up, which is fine. It kind of sucks because I did. I killed their general right off because he was being dumb. But just my, I lost so many men just getting to and up the walls. Yeah, that's right. I mean, sh shaking the cobwebs off. We haven't played this in a while. So. It's true. Well, I I forgot how brutal the climbing was. Yeah. Oh, there goes your general. Oh no! Shit! I just watched him. Watch. Remember when I said the fight animations finally got right? Um, not quite. Did he, uh, did they he were about... the oblivion? No, they were about five. So he got he got chopped in the head with a uh, with a sword, but the sword was about five feet to the right of his body. <laughs> Ignore that part. Ignore that. So if you were looking at it at the correct angle, then it looks like he got you know chopped, but not well, the yep. angle I was looking at it. I think the whole army just died. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's what? I lost enough men, and it's winter, and the general's dead. I think they all just vanished. Okay, well, uh, we'll just call that a mulligan for your first battle. Hopefully my first battle goes a little better. <laughs> Through the magic of editing. Oh, look, I won! Yeah, I mean, we could probably fiddle with something. I don't know. Oh, yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure. Just come back, the whole map's covered in me. See, that battle was so impactful. Yeah, yeah, that'd be fun to do if it wouldn't take 20 hours. Yeah. Yep, nope, I lost my army. That's, I'll uh, this is going a long way for a joke. A joke that I don't think anyone, even ourselves, would appreciate. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like that was, that was lame and boring. I'm not really satisfied with this. Let's uh, just delete this and uh, put it in the trash. Yeah, never touch this again. We're failures. So... Who are you going for? Are you going for the pink people or the green people? Whoever I started off at war with. Hey, are we going to war? Are we, after your colossal failure, are we uh, getting peace with the Yamanuchi? Let's get peace. Just just go peaceful. All right, we're giving peace a chance here. Give there peace we go. a chance. No, they didn't even ask me. They're just like, ha, you lost. Deal with it. Well, no, they're probably gunning for you next. 
they're no longer a peaceful society. We have turned them to war. Yeah, pretty much. You taught them how to hate. Oh, good. We survived the winter with minimal losses. Did, what did you do? Just eat, end up eating all your horses and stuff? Uh, no, we actually cut our horses open and slept inside them, Tauntaun style. Well, the smell's awful, but, you know. Eh, it's not as bad as the smell on the inside. Alright, so I'm gonna save for Is it safety. my turn? My turn to try to be a cameraman? <laughs> yep, your turn to try to camera. Now see, your battle is just bigger. So Yeah, because I, uh, I, you know, picked up a few more dudes. You're also fighting in a square instead of a rather... I'm just gonna straight up say a rather phallic fort. It was not a phallic fort. It was it was completely symmetrical. Sure. If was. anything, it was a it was a very squat H. Also, I just want to just want to throw it out there. They stuck you right behind a rock. Yeah, they did. I did. You don't want to stay there? Come on, high ground. Just climb that thing. All right. So I don't want to go up that thing. Maybe I do. I've got horses. So is there a what kind of spectator mode were you using? I'm just kind of uh, press, the camera. Press K. Every oh ah oh, 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 that's cooler. So I'm gonna assault this wall right here. In my brain, it's a shorter climb, so I'm gonna lose fewer guys. I don't know if that's actually gonna happen though. I believe what you're saying. Yeah. Hey, uh, quick question, Justin. When you assaulted that wall, did you put your dudes in light formation? Um, I think my guys were in tight formation. My archers were in loose formation. Ah, okay. Were were you gonna say tight formations worse or loose? I just want I no no I just wasn't sure if you remembered that was a thing in this game. Yeah, I put I put my archers in loose. My spearmen I kept in tight because I didn't know if when they got to the top of the wall if that would affect things or not. Ah, yeah, that's why I usually that's what I'm usually afraid of. Also, while wow, you're right, you've got a big hunk of wall right there. Oh, I've got samurai retainer too. Nice, nice little mud fort. Yeah, mud, mud, mud. Some rocks in the yard, some cut down trees. Oh, a flower petal. Well, that's... Ooh, Ooh, they have a lot of dudes. Yes, they do. They've got. Let's see what we're looking at here today. We got these cool guys. I like their coloration. I respect it. Yeah, the one of the things I did actually really like about this game, I haven't mentioned yet, is so while the game's much harder, part of that is because almost every single, uh, I guess you can call them civilization, every single faction or whatever. Yeah. Basically has the same chance as everyone else of winning. Just Some just have a distinction of major faction. Yeah, that's pretty much it. And everybody pretty much has a... the exact same thing. Like, one culture will have a better archer or a better spearman or a better swordsman. But, like, it doesn't seem to make too much of a difference on the field of battle. Nah, not really. It's mostly just a big game of rock, paper, scissors. And this is what I hate about the AI. They know the second I click on them that I'm going to shoot at them, and they move. They don't wait until they start getting hit. They don't wait until they see the arrows flying. They respond to me clicking on them. Watch. I'll click this unit here, and they start running. Ah! It's almost like the AI knows what you're doing. Yeah. Are we both going to have a terrible first fight? Uh, I, don't, I don't know. Maybe. You know, in your defense, you have a shorter wall, so I think you can make it. I believe in you. I believe. I believe in the power of Shinto. Eh, hey, don't, don't, don't believe in that. <laughs> <laughs> Just, it's, it's not doing some of these guys so well. No, it isn't. Oh, jeez, that guy has an arrow in his chest and his thigh and his kneecap. I'm like, dude. However, it is cool, though, um, with that note, these guys aren't dead. They're simply wounded. Oh, good. Huh. At least they shrug it off. I mean, they're 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 down. You're not going to fight with them anymore, but... I bet some of them aren't... Well, they're, they're, they're stopping their writhing here. I bet some of them are going to get, you know, make it through. Oh, he's not in that grave of danger. <laughs> Five seconds later, arrows go straight through him. I know. All right, maybe he's in a little bit of danger. Oh, jeez. Um, I think what? your arrows are doing more damage to them than you, but... Well, I'm not even bothering to target the guys on the wall. Oh, shit, Rally. My guys just stopped climbing this wall because they got in a fight. That sucks. The AI isn't perfect. It was just better in this game. Yeah. 
This guy's gonna fall. I, I'm watching this one guy climb. I'm like, he's gonna fall. I don't believe in him. Mm. It's wet and rainy outside. You gonna make it, buddy? You're almost there. Keep climbing. I'm just gonna watch him. I'm, I want to see him make it to the top, even though at the top is a welcoming committee for him. Uh, well, he made it to an easy, nice ledge. So now he's just got some wood he's got to climb over. Yeah, there you go. Up, oh, up. Oh, he made it. He made it. Little, little, little Jimity here. Little Jimity is um made up. Jimity saw. Yeah, I think he died. Um. So what do you have left? I see three archer units that are getting peppered. Oh, General's dead. Shit. Well, I am sorry for your loss. I think little Jimity here has died. Uh, his little crew he was fighting with is pretty much dead. I'm going to claim this guy's Jimity here. Oh, well. Sorry, buddy. Didn't mean to claim that you were Jimity. And charge. I don't see anyone really left. Um, they're all running away like little pansies now. Come on, at least fight for a little bit longer. Now let's take a zoom in at the pile of bodies and remorse about this sad moment. Okay, remorsing over. <laughs> remorsing ceased. Remorsing ceased. Okay. I think we got a little too eager to get straight to the fighting. I waited for the siege to expire. Usually, though, the first battles aren't too bad. Usually, yeah. From the battlefield. Ah, oh, you. You're in charge of something cool. You keep firing that bow. You show that you're like the Japanese legless of the world. And by Japanese yeah. legless, I mean, I mean, you ain't killing any elephants anytime soon. But good start. I this guess. is good killing start. something. How many kills have these guys gotten? Ninety-eight. Not too bad. Wait. Yeah, nine. Is that kills? I think that's kills. So, what do you have left? Is just the two archer cores? Yeah, just the two archers. Well. How's their ammo? <laughs> yeah, not too bad, actually. Really? Do they have enough arrows that if they were all perfect marksmen, they could snipe everyone? Absolutely not. Okay. This is this is my moment. They're going to climb the walls, and they're going to take the day. Those those bow off Shigaru, yes, they are. <laughs> Do you, what were your samurai? Up oh, and out. Jeez, they're just falling down the wall. <laughs> yeah, I think the rain does affect their climb up. They're like ants trying to climb up the like the side of a cliff a in a bathtub. rainstorm. I don't know yes. if you've seen that. They just fall when that happens. It's really sad. That guy's a flag sticking out of him. Oh, well, at least we've almost shot these guys to pieces. Um, so you're out of ammunition. And there she goes. Okay, well. Did they just I run away? I that a, a massive failure. Okay, all right, Justin, well... You had a good time, didn't you? Yeah, I guess we'll just end it on a high note. With uh, everyone not a did. high note. Yeah, not a high note for us, a high note for them. Uh, you know, people don't really think about how the AI feels when they're playing these games. And, you know, I just thought, why don't we give them a win for once? So, the next time we play this, <laughs> we're, gonna we're not going to hold anything back. We're definitely not going to lose on purpose like we definitely just did. Um... We're so being humble next, right now. Yeah, this is called being humble. You have to, you have to remember your roots because you know we all started where the AI started. We we're all just kind of struggling, computer, and code? not really knowing what we're doing. Yeah, as computer code. Um, but anyway, next time we get on, we'll probably do better. Uh, anyway, I'll see you next time, Justin. Yep.